Okay, so these are finally dry. I wanted to show you, I coated it very well, even in the seams right here. And all the seams, it coated it very well. I needed to fill this in and it did that for uh, the most part. And, as you can tell, this is very squishy. Up here, it is very hard to push it in. And the great thing is, pretty much just wipes right out. Now I did put a, one extra coat on this one that I did not put on this one. So this one's a little bit thinner. But as you can tell, this just comes right out. And it is very, very thick and hard to push on. I mean, you can just literally see it right there, it's bounced back already. Whereas this has a lot of give to it. This doesn't, except for these little bitty tiny pieces, but I'm not worried about that. So, I'm going to do a test walk and then show you the result. Okay, so I just completed my test walk, literally took them off, turned them upside down. As you can tell, there's going to be plenty of rocks stuck in these things. This one went down quite a bit, so I'm waiting. I'm going to see what happens. I even have a pine cone stuck in here. Walking is definitely going to be the hardest thing on these. Might coat it a couple more times. But it's not going to be rocks on it in conventions, so not too worried. But, other than being a little bit rough, roughed up, it held very well. Nothing came off. That's always a good thing. Oh, yeah. You can even see here that this is slowly coming back into its original shape. So I'm very happy with this. I might buy another can and coat it a couple more times just to give it that little extra protection. But other than that, oh yeah, totally recommend this. This is going to give that literally rubber sole like you have on your shoes. Because yes, these are going to be the boots I wear. In here. Mm. Yeah. I'll put this to seal the knee guard to the shin. And I'll put a plate down there that this move through. Yes, I even have little blood drops. Alright, let's turn this over. Let's see, here's the underside. A plate that is literally mounted directly to the boot that that hole's cut in. 